Hey guys, Steve here. We're, today we're going to talk about remineralization tanks. So, how remineralization tanks work are, first we take the first pole off of our filter over there, uh, and we take the thickest stuff and we put it in here into our worm bin. That thick sludgy fish waste uh, is a little bit too thick, doesn't break down super great. We mix it in with the roots and the leaves and everything, and then once it's been processed by the worms, it looks like this. Really nice worm vermicompost, filled with fish waste and everything else. And then what we do is we take the second pull off of the, the filters, uh, which is a little more liquidy, and we put that in the remineralization tanks. And it goes into here and it, it gets brewed and brewed and brewed. And here's a quick video inside. Then what we'll do with that is, we're going to let this brew, we started this yesterday, it's going to brew all the way until it finishes up uh, uh, on Wednesday. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna shut it off on Wednesday morning, if the solids are going to settle, we're gonna be left with clear water on top, then we can siphon the clear water and put it back into the system, providing super mineral rich water uh, and provide unlocking significantly more nutrients for our aquaponics system from our fish waste than we would traditionally be able to do. This gives us a huge boost in micronutrients as well as phosphorus and a few other nutrients as well. Um, we've also been experimenting with uh, adding different microbial inoculants to further unlock this and had tremendous results. So if you're looking and wondering how you actually get more nutrients from your fish waste specifically, this is the best way to do it. And this is all run by this little blower here uh, that also powers our compost tea uh, tanks as well. When they are up and running, they are currently not. We usually run those later in the week for the weekend for all the cannabis growers that stop by over the weekend. So um, thanks a lot for watching. And if you have any questions, hit that subscribe button and uh, leave a comment below. Thank you.